Hi, this is Chef Omega, and today we're going to be testing an RTD for functionality. In order to do this, we're going to need our multimeter, our mini hook test leads, one PR11 100 ohm free wire RTD, and one RTD830 free wire RTD. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my meter and I'm going to set it to ohms. Now, when checking an RTD, it's good to check across the node and also the element. First, I'm gonna take my mini hook leads and I'm gonna check across the node. And right now I'm reading about 0.6 ohm. Now when reading across the node, you wanna read close to zero or just around one. And now I'm gonna take one of my leads and now I'm gonna measure across the element itself. Since we're in room temperature, we should be reading around anywhere from 115 to 109 ohm. So, that's pretty accurate. This RTD is functional. Let's move over to the RTD 830. Now this RTD has a connector. On our connectors, we have the red dot to measure what is actually the positive side of the RTD. So, I'm gonna take my jump lead here, and I measure it across the node, and I'm getting about 0.6 ohm. Now I'm gonna take one of my leads and jump over to the element, and again, I should be reading somewhere around 109. I'm reading 109.3, so this RTD is also functional. And that's how you test an RTD for functionality. I hope this has helped you. If you have any questions, give us a call.